Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm actually really excited for making this video because um, if you saw the vlog um, on Saturday, um, then I got two new hamsters, and teddies and those two updates. So the names for them are Silver and Shadow. So the one that is silver is a little bit more lighter than shadow because shadow is more darker and you can really see that you can tell but i don't really have any pictures or anything because they're quite young so i don't really want to take any pictures now is teddy's about second year um with us so 2017 here is he is so teddy is quite good um but silver and shadow they they're now living out in the hole they're not in my room actually because i only have teddy and i don't want more hamsters right now in my room um fighting mm, they did have one in the ball because i think the one was jealous of like silver was getting out the most because he wanted to but shadow is more like the he doesn't really want to but he's like really jealous of his brother that he could like go out but so for food i'm giving them i'm not giving them a lot of food because um they're two small hamsters so i'm not going to give them a lot but i'm giving them the hamster nature one um it's not beginning to be empty it's just that it's halfway through uh, but they don't need any more food now because their food bill is quite full with their hamster food from the uh like um their travel cage and then they had a little bit in their uh, food bowl when they arrived. A dog bowl is quite huge. Like Teddy can fit in it like like that. Like he he's trying to see if there's food in there. Uh, he can fit in this, but they're too small. If you just I don't know this is gonna sound weird. If you just take Teddy in three halves, it will be three hamsters actually, and that will be Silver and Shadow when um, two of them. So yeah, but he he fits more in the dog bowls. That is why I buy these dog bowls because um, they're quite nice though. Even though they're dogs bowls, like why not use them for hamsters? So when I made the little hamsters cage, um, like the one I already have shown you in the vlog, um, I used the new bedding that I got. I used the blue one since there's two boys. Uh, why not? Uh, Teddy has got some in his cage as well. Okay, he, he really wants to get in there. I used this as a cage as well. I just mixed it up with some uh, other bedding. So I mixed it up with two other bedding. So it looks like it looks really, really cool. You buy the pink one as well because you never know. But the thing is that even though they're not girls, like, come on. It's okay. Boys can have like pink too um yeah there's so many judgments but the blue bedding was the one um i caught my or the pink one was that i would call my eye on but i was like oh if they had this in blue and then i just like looked under it's like oh my god they have blue so we bought this and it was quite nice um, it was just in a little cage and they were from sweden actually which is so excited so first time having swedish hamsters i thought i I don't think we ever had Swedish hamsters. Something I use in their cage is for like they can pee and poop. Yeah, pretty much. Um, but I use this very often because small hamsters really love this. So I'm using chinchilla sand, which is for pretty much every... There we go. For everyone, you probably heard that this is a favorite from Teddy. But the thing is, is that... Um, like i really know if there's a fave but i use this in their cage to see but they haven't really gone pooping and peeing there because um silver actually peed on me and i think that was because he was scared at the first but 
that was okay. I was just in my pajamas, so it wasn't really like I just have sh pajama shorts on, so it, it was okay. I just peed on my knees, and that was totally fine by me. Um, I understand that because Teddy, he always pooped on me when he was like really, really scared, but now he just poops everywhere, pretty much. Yeah, I'm, I'm talking about you, little boy. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much an update on the boys. Like, I do. I had one hamster that was a girl, and that was Lizzie. That was all like, I, I don't know. I just really love boy hamsters, um, even though they have a huge bum. Like, Teddy now has this, like, seriously such a huge bum. Um, I'm not like blaming him for that, but it's it's a little bit weird now. He's enjoying uh, The food that I just gave him uh, he loves food. He's like absolutely a favorite there um, I am gonna just say one more thing about Teddy. I just saw he has a little bit thing on his little toe But I think he will right because he, he's a hamster, I think he'll he'll survive. He is like absolutely survive even though he has like like a big sore or anything on his feet, he's like totally fine with it. But I really hope you enjoyed this hamster update. I'll totally give you a hamster update in April and I'll see you next week. Um I really hope you enjoying these videos that are coming because you probably already have probably have seen them. Um because um, I just... Anyway, I'll see you tomorrow. No, I don't. I'll see you on Saturday. Bye, guys. For now. <laughs>